I grabbed one of these Jingle Bell ornaments from Dollar Tree. Doesn't matter what color you grab. So first I'm using Waverly Chalk Paint in the color Elephant. You could use any gray color and then go ahead and just paint the entirety of that bell. Go ahead, let that dry. Using some black acrylic paint or chalk paint, I just started dabbing that all throughout the bell. As you could tell, I didn't cover it entirely. I still have some of that gray peeking through. And before that black starts to dry, I then am going in with some brown acrylic paint. Every now and then, add a little bit of orange and just mix all of those colors together. Blending is key. Just keep adding and blending and you will get this awesome rustic look. Once you have your desired look, go ahead and let that completely dry. Look at how awesome that looks. Next, I just use some jute string for my hanger. And then I use some of this white and black buffalo check ribbon and I just created a little bow out of it and I just hot glued it to the top of the ornaments. Next, using some more jute string, I am just hot gluing a little dab in the center of the bell, placing down the end of that jute string, and then I am just rotating it all around the bell and fill this up until you are satisfied, but I'm only keeping the jute string in between the top and the bottom of the bell. And then just add a dab of hot glue just to hold the end in place. So now for this next scenario, grab that same bell using some of this brown acrylic paint just to start off as the base coat. Go ahead and allow that to completely dry. And then we're gonna be doing the Mod Podge and Cinnamon Technique. This is super easy. All you have to do is just start adding some Mod Podge. I like to just dab it on with my paintbrush, pour on some cinnamon, have something there underneath to grab any excess so you could put it back into your jar. But once you apply the cinnamon, go ahead and add some more Mod Podge right on top. Again, I am doing this in a dabbing motion. I am not brushing this on, dab, dab, dab. And if you start seeing some of that cinnamon start lifting up, just add a little bit more with some more Mod Podge. Created another little bow and just hot glued that right to the top of the bow. And also use that jute string as my hanger. And there you go, guys. Now I just showed you guys how to create the russic look using two different techniques. I love both of these techniques. They are so fun. And what a great addition for your Christmas tree or a wreath, wherever you want to use these bells. I hope it inspires you guys to create your own. If it did, please be sure to sprinkle the love. Thank you so, so much. And I hope you all have a good rest of your day. Thanks. Bye.